All right, we've got a truckload of toys with us today because we're heading to a garage sale. Our buddy is hosting one at his mansion here in Elk Mountain, and we're going to go ahead and bring some toys over. We're going to list them for sale and see if we get any action on them and sell them because we no longer use any of this stuff. We've got a Razor, two super bikes, and we've also got a limousine back there, and I don't need them anymore. So we're going to try and sell them to the local neighborhood, and we're going to pull up there. He said he's got some of his own stuff for sale. So let's check it out. He said he left some space for us to unload. There he is. I think he's checking out all the vehicles he's got for sale. So let's back up the semi and trailer. Get these things unloaded here. All right, let's get the straps off the bikes. Looks good. We got the limousine. Ramps are down. This thing's a V12 Maybach limousine. So this is pretty nice i do have to say it's uh, an extended mercedes benz yeah this is clean check out the interior on this all right awesome let's back it off the trailer here we'll get it positioned up and this is definitely not your typical garage sale like i said this is a luxury mansion garage sale only the finest of vehicles so you're gonna need to have a nice checkbook if you're gonna be buying vehicles from this place because kind of that's all we're selling we're not selling too many miscellaneous stuff we've got a submarine right there that's insane we're going to back the limousine up right here in this empty spot with the for sale sign. Looks good. And then I think we've got some uh, some empty spaces right here. So we got one. Maybe we'll put the bikes right there and then something can go right in the middle. So, all right, next up, we got to grab the super bikes. Obviously, with this being a garage sale, we have to uh, mark these things down a little bit. So I think we're going to list these for a good $45,000. That's right. And then we're also going to list the limousine for like $150,000, which is actually not bad. Wow, this thing is not drive very good. That's why I'm getting rid of it. So let's just walk the thing over. There we go. And then we'll spin it around, make it look nice. Look at that. Okay, let's get the other one unloaded. And then we just got that Polaris four-door to unload. That thing will probably sell today. That's a pretty sweet bike. All right, second bike is there. Let's grab the Polaris. Let's get that unloaded. I honestly might want to put that one in the front because it's kind of like the best vehicle. Okay, we're going to put the lime green four-door in the front, kind of next to the limousine because this thing's definitely going to sell today. There we go. Put it on the sidewalk here. So Okay, we are all set up for the garage sale. We just got to put some signs around the area. Let people know that we've got a garage sale going on. We actually made a, a local newspaper announcement. At least my buddy did, but the address. So hopefully some people are going to start rolling up here. We're going to park this in the parking lot right next to us. So it's on the way, but we're all set up. We got for sale signs. We'll remove them as soon as we sell each vehicle, which will work out pretty good. And if you guys are excited for this garage sale episode, make sure to drop a like on today's episode and maybe we'll make a part two. All right, semi's good to go. Let's head on over, and we're going to wait for the first uh, amount of people to show up. I think our buddy is getting the lemonade stand going. He's actually got a full Capri Sun bar over here, so that's pretty sweet. I'll see you guys when the first uh, local customer comes on in. Looks like we got our first customer. Hey, sir, how's it going? Uh, welcome to the garage sale. We've got a lot of stuff here to show you. If you don't mind, I'll show you around what, kind of what we've all got. We've got pretty much everything. We've got four-wheelers. Over there, we've got another off-road utility vehicle. This is the Polaris Razor. So if you're looking for off-road, we've got it for you. Uh, also, we've got limousine, kind of a little bit of everything. What are you looking for today? A sports car. Okay, well, I've got that too. Check it out over here. Audi R8. This is my buddy, Eddie's, and uh, he's selling this thing. So maybe uh, we'll give you a good deal on it. It's a garage sale. Yeah, keys in the uh, center console. Go ahead and fire it up if you want. Yeah, V8, baby. Or actually, I'm sorry. There's a V10. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Sir, sir, you got to pay for that. Stop, stop, stop. Step out of the vehicle, please. Uh, you're going to have to pay for that before you can take it for a test drive here. Oh, you'll give us $5,000 to take it for a test drive, and then you'll think about buying it. Okay, fine. If you don't buy it, though, we keep your five grand. All right, just down the street. Take it easy. Okay, he gave us $5,000 to, uh, you know, test drive that thing, so that's fine. Look, he's doing a donut. Oh, look at that. Hopefully, Eddie does not get mad at me, but all right, he's pulling back in. I don't think he's gonna steal it yeah there we go hey welcome in how was it a little bit of a rip down the street yeah watch the front lawn i don't think eddie's gonna be too happy about that okay yeah you're clear swing it yeah yeah, yeah. we can negotiate up over here oh yep yep hey oh well, yeah we can uh, negotiate numbers with you what are you thinking of buying it for right okay yeah, yeah. let me uh, talk to eddie over here and i'll see what he can do I just talked to Eddie. He said that he could do 140,000 even that's the lowest he'd go so we'll start him at like 150 Hey, yeah, we can do 150 for it. Oh, you can't, you can't do 150. Okay. Uh, what about 149.999? Oh, you can't do that either. Okay. All right. Uh, let's meet in the middle. 145 even. Sold. All right, sir. Yep. The keys are in it, and the title's in it too. So, thanks for uh, coming to the local Eddie Garage Sale. Eddie and Ian Garage Sale. See ya. Well, first customer gone. Oh my gosh, he's gonna wreck the thing, and he's even had it for like a minute. All right. Well. We sold that thing, 145 even, pretty easy. And uh, we got some other stuff here. I didn't show you guys the rest of it. We got Lions, a golf cart, and this is a can and Renegade. This thing is built out like crazy. This is all Eddie's stuff too. I, I don't know why he has this, but 
He's getting rid of the lion statues. He said he's getting zebra statues next. So, hey, whatever he wants to do. Here's his mansion. I'll give you guys a quick little tour of it. It's pretty sweet. I do have to say he's got kitchen right here. He's got a dining table. The backyard is honestly probably the best part here. Look at this pool. Triple waterfall. What else we got? Oh, yep. Hot tub. I didn't show you guys this. And it's also like surrounded by a forest. So you don't have neighbors, you know, next to you, which is kind of cool. He's got the Capri Sun bar. And then over here, you got some loungers. He's got a pool in his tree. This man is crazy. And then this is like his garage. He honestly doesn't even have a garage, but it's all cool. He's got a giant couch right there. Over upstairs, we've got a plant wall, galaxy ceiling. And then go over here. He's got one bedroom in this entire house, but it's the most insane bedroom you'll think of. Oh, look at this. This walk-in closet. You got a bathroom and another walk-in closet. Here, I'll show you the bathroom first. Check it out. Oh, look at the shower. This is sweet. I think he's actually got another bathroom. I thought he had a bathtub. Uh, Maybe over here. Hold on. Of course, he does have a bathtub. Look at this. He's got a double bathroom. This has still got water in it. All right. Oh, someone's yelling downstairs. We got to go. Someone's down there. Hold on. I've got a quick escape route. We're going to jump off. And then land right here. Ready? Three, two, one. Hey, sir. Welcome on in to the local garage. Yeah, what can I do for you? You just here to check it out? You saw the sign? Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, let me show you around. We got limos, off-road vehicles, submarines. If you're looking to do anything crazy, this is definitely legal, okay? You could take a submarine. And then also we've got statues, kind of a little bit of everything if you want. You can uh, steal some bottles from the Capri Sun bar, whatever you want, man. Oh, you're interested in this? Okay, this is a Yamaha. Yep. I mean, uh, Can-Am, Can-Am, sorry. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, fire it up. How's it sound? Yeah, V8. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, it is a nice engine, though. You've got the snorkel package in case you're going, like, underwater and stuff. It'll still stave out of the water for exhaust purposes. And then, you know, that's pretty much it. Yep, yep, yep. Hey, sir, 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 stop, 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 sir. Hey, what's he doing? Eddie! Oh, no, I need to get Eddie out of here. Hey, sir, you can't touch that vehicle. Get out of here. We're kicking you out. Get out of here. I don't know what that guy's intentions were, but he crashed the Can-Am Renegade. I think he was trying to steal the thing. There we go. Let's get it set back up. I think we're not going to do any more test drives here. Let's park this thing up. No more test drives unless they're serious buyers. We're having some scammers come through. All right, there we go, Can-Am. It just feels like a garage sale and with vehicles. Everyone wants to test drive it. I don't know why, but they feel like it doesn't run or something. So, all right, let's try and sell a couple more things here. Hopefully, we get some more people coming on in. Hey, bro. Welcome on into the garage shell. Uh, take a look around, and if you see anything, let me know. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got a, a golf cart over here, if you're interested in that, going golfing with the boys. Doesn't have the golf package over here. Oh, you want you want the submarine? Okay. Oh, uh, hold on. I got to ask Eddie on the number for this thing, because uh, this is his. So give me uh, 30 seconds here. Yo, Eddie, what's the price of the submarine out front? All right, got it. Uh, 490000 is the uh, price that you could take this thing home today. And actually, I'll personally ship it for you. I've got a semi, truck, and trailer. Yep, it's pretty sweet. Oh, I can't hear him now. Hold on. I got to climb up top. Sir, I can't hear you. Step out. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So 499000 and I'll ship it for you for another five. Okay, so 505 and you're out the door. Oh, okay. That's cool. So you're an explorer in the Arctic. Okay, so you go like deep sea fishing with... Wait, no, that's a summary. Never mind. Um, yeah, yeah. So let's get this thing sold. Wire the money to this account, and then I'll, I'll ship it to your house for you. How far is your house? Not far? Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, sounds good. All right, we sold the submarine, but we're going to have to deliver that thing when the garage sale is closed today. We got the uh, four-wheeler here, some statues. We got to sell some more stuff. I feel like we've only sold, like, well, technically we've sold two things. We had a scammer, so we need to get some more people in. Hopefully, they'll start flooding in more, but I want to get rid of our vehicles. We still have the Mercedes-Benz, the bikes, and the Polaris, so hopefully someone could buy. It feels like just Eddie's stuff is getting interested, but Eddie does have cool things, so maybe we'll sell something eventually. Hey, sir. Welcome on into the garage sale. Uh, I've got a special deal for you if you're interested. All right, step this way. So if you're interested, you know, a nice dinner out on the town. I've got this Mercedes-Benz Maybach. This V12 engine comes with a driver. It's got, you know, the full package deal here for uh, 150000 if you're interested. For you, I could do 142. Sold. Okay, that was quick. That was quick. Not much convincing for this guy. Okay. Yep, you go ahead and take it home. Here's the keys, the title, and you're good to go. Listen to that V12 purr. All right, have a good one. And he's off into the trees. Hey, take a left. There you go. I don't think he's used to driving a limousine. Whoa, he just curbed it. All right, there he goes. All right, we got to have another happy customer. So let's try and get rid of some other stuff. These ones are cheaper. We got rid of the most expensive ones, the Audi, the Submarine, and now the Mercedes. So we only got like the off-road toys, I would say, left. So let's try and sell our Polaris here to the next guy. We'll do the same trick, this special deal, and uh, we'll say your price, but it's actually, you know, I don't know. I'm not going to say anything else. I'll see you guys in the next customer gets here. Hey there, sir. How's it going? 
Oh, you're a fellow farmer. Okay, okay, got it. Um, yeah, I actually got some vehicles if you're interested for your farm. We don't have tractors, but we do have something that might be in your range of vehicles here. Check it out. If you need to explore the crops in the springtime, this is just the vehicle for you. This thing will get you through the fields. You won't get stuck in it, and you can check out the crop, make sure it's growing correctly. Yeah, jump in, jump in. It's the Polaris 1000 Turbo. Wait, sir, don't start it up, please. Sir, sir. Hey, stop the vehicle. No, 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 no. You're not going to steal this. Stop, stop, stop. Are you guys ready? Watch this. Turn off. Ah, look at that. I got another remote with me. Step out of the vehicle. Or I'm going to call the cops. Oh, you're just test driving. Okay. Well, uh, maybe don't do that next time. Uh, okay. $20,000 is yours. Got it, farmer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Nineteen five. All right, done. Here. Here's the keys. That was easy. I don't know what he was doing there, but that was an easy sale. Uh, okay. See you, farmer. Well, all right, we got some vehicles left here. We've got a four-wheeler, we got a golf cart, and a couple other bikes. So I'll see you guys when the next customer, or maybe the final customer, comes in. We're going to get close here. It's about 5.30. We close at 6. And we're not doing a day two, so we'll be done. I want to sell these statues, too. These things are expensive, man. Eddie was saying in the ballpark of 50000 They're rare statues, so maybe we could sell those. Let's take this sign down here. Hey, sir, welcome to the garage sale. What can I do for you? Oh, you're looking to buy something? Okay, we've got all the best deals in town because, you know, we're a garage sale. We've got three things left. Well, technically five, but uh, let me show you around. So we've got these two super bikes. If you're interested in living life on the wild side, they're Kawasaki's ZH2s. Uh, pretty fast bikes. Do you have to say from experience? I have not robbed a bank with that. And then we've got a golf cart lifted on some custom rims. Check it out. If you're looking to go golfing with the boys, this is your uh, your golf cart of choice here. And then we've also got a four-wheeler left and then two lion statues. So uh, what are you looking for today? You want to buy it all? Well, you're going to have to show me some money if you want to leave with all this stuff today. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cut a check for 119000 even. Everything is yours. Oh, he actually... He actually paid me. Okay, yeah, it's all yours. Here's the keys. Be careful on that bike. Now, you might want to wear a helmet. You know, I, I made a few crashes in my past. Hey! Uh, well, he gave me the money, so... I think that's where we call it, guys. Thanks for watching today's episode. We've officially sold everything. That was, uh, that was pretty crazy. The last guy came in, bought everything. If you want to see us come back for part two and do another garage sale at Eddie's Mansion, I, I think he's sleeping upstairs. He made me do all the work. Well, whatever. He let me use his mansion for selling, so I'll, uh, I'll give him his money. But, guys, thanks for watching. If you want to see us come back, like I said, like button down below and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.